hello, it is Cheap Nails Happy Nails Day for Good Nail Art. And in this video, I'm going to be swatching and reviewing the Glam Globe from Beauty Spot. I've already put a base coat on my natural nails, so let's get started and see those colors. First up is this lovely purple polish. Now, these polishes do not have names, but there was five of them in that super cute little globe. So let's go ahead and swatch this first one on my index finger. This one was definitely pretty much opaque on one coat. I went ahead and threw on another coat, but it is very pretty. It's a shimmery purple, and it is really, actually really nice. Now, these polishes all, even though I never noticed nail polish smells, these these polishes kind of smell like spray paint, like they kind of have a funny smell, it's kind of weird. But I do like the brush that comes with these polishes, that is very nice. And here's the second coat of that purple polish. I think it is very pretty, I really liked wearing this one on my nails. Okay, moving on to the next one is this kind of creamy, it has a very kind of light pink undertone too and it's like a shimmer, kind of a metallic shimmer. This one is definitely not opaque in its first coat like the purple one. You definitely need to throw it on a second coat but you know what? I expected this polish to not be opaque at all but it's pretty opaque on the first coat. So I went ahead and threw out another coat. I really like these polishes because they came in a super cute globe. Like that is so cute. And if you've been watching my videos, you know that I put a squirrel in the globe because I didn't want to put the nail polish back in the globe. So I went ahead and put Steve the squirrel in the globe. And there we go, that one's so pretty. Let's move on to the next one. Now this one is very similar to the other one I just swatched, but it has kind of a gold undertone to it than a pink. But it's basically the same, just but with the gold instead of pink. And I, it was definitely not opaque in one, its first coat, but you know, we always need a second coat, don't we? I always paint a second coat on anyway, so I went ahead and just painted another coat of it on. By the way, Steve, who lives in the happy little globe, the globe that came from these balloons, is actually an ornament that my mom gave me, and it's like handmade, and it's so cute, and I just, I didn't know where to put him because he's kind of fragile, but now Steve's in his happy little globe. There we go, that is two coats of it, and I think it is so pretty, and I can't believe it's fully opaque in two coats, I couldn't believe that. Okay, moving on to the next polish, which is this shimmery orange polish. The shimmer and it's kind of red, it's, you know, it's like it's orange, but the shimmer is kind of red, it's very pretty. And I'm gonna go ahead and swatch that on my pinky finger, and have you guys noticed that this is my first video with my new nail shape. I always had a long almond shape for my videos when my nails uh, finally grew out, but now I have, I wanted to cut them and shape them. So uh, now I kind of have my ballerina slash coffin style there and I'm really liking it. What do you guys think? Do you like my almond nail better or this nail shape better? Let me know down in the comment section down below. But I've been really liking this ballerina nail. It's a little bit shorter than my almond shape, but I just had to cut it so I could shape it. And I got a video coming out about that soon, how I shape these, so look out for that. But here is two coats of that wonderful orange polish. It was almost pushing a third coat, but I think I got away with two coats. Okay, moving on to the last polish that was in that wonderful globe is this wonderful sparse pink glitter. I think it's just kind of clear polish with little hexagon glitter in it. And I like simple little glitters. I like like simple glitter polishes. Now don't get me wrong, I love glitter polishes full of the, all the different shapes of glitter, but I do like sparse glitter, like I do nail it with sparse glitter. Okay, I painted my thumb white just so it would show up more because it's just a clear polish with uh, little hexagon glitters in it. And this is what it looks like when you just paint it on, and it's pretty sparse because it's a sparse glitter. So I went ahead and grabbed my handy dandy. Uh, makeup sponge and I went ahead and put some of it on the makeup sponge and then I sponged it on you know it kind of looks like a like a birthday nail like it just instantly made this white polish that I have on kind of look like it's like a birthday nail I really like it I like sparse glitters and I, I don't know I just like sparse glitters I think it's very pretty and here I was all the polishes without top coat on I think they're very beautiful I like them and I'm so happy that I received this glam globe as a gift because it's now a happy little globe and it keeps my kind of fragile looking squirrel safe. So I definitely like these polishes. Tell me which one is your favorite. My favorite is probably the purple but I really like the sparse glitter and I just like all of them. I just love nail polish so I definitely like all of them. Did you guys like this swatching review? Please give it a like if you liked it and remember to subscribe if you're new here because I would love to have you back 
for another video because I do a lot of fun cheap nail art and reviews and all sorts of awesome videos. Thank you so much for watching and you can click or tap the screen if you want to watch another one of my videos and I will see you next Friday. Bye!